Alejandro Guerra was asking us why are the effects of dark matter not observable in the motion of planets in the solar system but observable in the motion of stars in the Milky Way. The answer is that this comes from the observations. What do I mean by that? Let's take a look at a planet which is orbiting the Sun. I take the Sun here, orbiting, and let's take a planet here, which is orbiting the Sun. So, Newtonian's laws of gravity tells us that from the motion of this planet around the Sun that if you want to know the orbital velocity of this planet, it is simply given by this relation. M v squared over R is equal to V M M over R squared. R is the distance of the planet to the Sun. Little m is the mass of the planet. And capital M is typically the mass of the Sun, which is the most heaviest, which should be around uh, in this imaginary sphere. So from this, what can we say? We can see that the velocity, the, the orbital velocity of the planet is given by the Newtonian, the, the, the gravitational constant times the mass over R. So what this tells us? This tells us that if a planet is far away from the sun, its velocity should be smaller. It means that if I take another planet here, here the, plan the one which is closer to the sun will have larger orbital velocity compared to the, this one and this one. So as a planet is far away from the sun, its, velo its orbital velocity decreases. And this is precisely what has been observed in the solar system, in the sense that the Newtonian law of gravity is perfectly describing the motion of planets in our solar system. Now, if we go in Milky Way, in galaxies like Milky Way, and we take, let me just draw also a star which is orbiting around the center of the galaxy at a distance r. And if we want to say that, okay, naively we would expect that the orbital velocity of the star, which is orbiting the center of this galaxy, should also follow the same Newtonian law of gravity, which is simply given by this expression. But this is not what has been observed. What has been observed is that as the star is far away from the center of the galaxy, its orbital velocity decreases. I'm going to make a plot here to show clearly what I mean. Here, you have here the orbital velocity and radial distance. So in a solar system, as I said here, as R, is large, this quantity decreases. And if you make a simple plot of that, you will find that if I assume that this is the center of the sun, so if you go far away from the sun, the velocity should be decreasing in this way, in the sense that the objects which are close to the center will have higher velocity than this. For example, you take the Mercury, you take Venus, and have that's the the velocity at which the Mercury is, should be orbi is orbiting around the Sun is greater than the one which is uh, for the Venus and which is in turn is larger for the one of the Earth. This is the Earth. This is Mercury. So this should follow precisely the Newtonian laws of gravity. But in the galaxies like Milky Way, that's not what has been observed. For instance, it has been found that as you go far away from the center of the, of the galaxy, as you go far away from the center, this orbital velocity tends to be constant. 
as you go far away from the center of the galaxy, the velocity tends to be constant, meaning that the quantity here, the quant this quantity here tends to be constant. This one being constant, only the this term here will be constant. Constant. This means that as the star is far away from this from the center of the galaxy, you need more mass to maintain this one constant. Precisely, thus, this additional mass that we don't see is what we call is called the dark matter. So, from the hypothesis, dark matter, if it exists in the solar system, it has to be in a very small amount in such a way that the effects are not observable with our current apparatus that we have. But in the galaxies like Milky Way, clearly this shows that if dark matter exists, it has to be the one responsible for this deviation from what we expect from Newtonian law of gravity.